Flooding is an age-long and most frequent disaster experienced in many parts of the globe. And Nigeria has had a fair share of destruction of lives and property resulting from flooding. Although experts say flooding is primarily induced by both natural and man-made factors. However, in the case of Abuja, the nation's capital, the flooding experienced is particularly as a result of human activities such as erecting of structures on floodplains and clogging of water channels due to indiscriminate dumping of refuse. This is further aggravated by a drainage system, which is inversely proportional to the increasing population. A situation town planning expert Abubakar Sadiq believes can be prevented by adequate planning. The way forward is actually uh, maintaining, being proactive in designs and being proactive in design and allocations of layout. Whenever they are going to do designs, they should be more defined uh, routes and channels at which river uh, uh, flood are going to naturally flu uh, flood when the rain uh, comes and defining the eye of the directions as well because sometimes you give a wrong directions and when the rain comes it will make itself uh, a flooding area and again where in situations where people have this uh, uh, attitude of uh, dumping refuse and blocking uh, drainages that are meant for a flow of water when they do it and the rain comes and if it can flow it has a cause and overflow Ni Olaloye heads the Department of the Federal Capital Territory Administration concerned with the maintenance and management of infrastructure within the city center he says his office carries out various projects to clear the drainages before and during the rainy season Every year, once the rainy season is uh, approaching, we normally do a general desilting of areas that we know or areas that have given us problems the previous year. We go back there, we we'll visit those places and desilt the drains and culverts, the sand traps and other underground uh, drainage structures that, that convey storm water whenever it rains. We do that before the rainy season sets in, and when the rainy season, uh, you know, comes in fully, we also, you know, go around whenever, whenever it rains to to identify places where we have uh, flooding, and then we package uh, solutions for them in terms of, uh, you know, minor contracts here and there to resolve those issues. The Director General, FCT Emergency Management Agency, FEMA, says residents can protect themselves from flooding by respecting construction rules and regulations and disposing of waste through the appropriate channel. As it is, if the, um, uh, the residents of the FCT will follow the pattern, the plan, the, the, master, the master plan of the FCT and then follow the do's and don'ts of the environmental guidelines, hygienic way of living. We find out that everything will go s smoothly because there is nothing like natural flooding in the FCT. All the areas that are flooding, you will find out that there are one factor or another. Unless these concrete measures are taken, analysts say flooding may continue to wreak more havoc. <laughs>